Welcome to today's daily devotional. I would like to read from Psalm 37 verses 23 and 24. The Lord makes firm the steps of the one who delights in him. Though he may stumble, he will not fall. For the Lord upholds him with his hand. The word delight and uphold stood out to me. So what is it to delight in the Lord? To delight is to take action, to take action of loving our God, of trusting in His plan and rejoicing in Him. It is to be greatly pleased in our Lord. And don't we have every reason to rejoice in our Lord? To us, He is our healer. He is our strength. He is our Prince of Peace. He is our Deliverer. He is our Father, our Counselor. He is our everything. And we need to trust in Him and believe that everything that our Lord does for us is for our good. The second verse reads, that though he may stumble, he will not fall. For the Lord upholds him with his hand. So even at situations when we may fall, we may fear, we may be anxious, we may doubt. But our God is with us through it all. He is with us. He is by our side. And He will make sure that we will not fall. Psalm 73 verse 26 reads, My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. God takes joy in those seeking to walk in His way, in His strength. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we adore You. Lord Jesus, we lift Your name on high. We sing praises to You, Lord. We delight in You. We rejoice in You. You alone are holy. You are worthy and we thank you, Lord, for every plan and purpose you have for us, Lord. At times, Lord, when things don't go the way we want them to go, forgive us for not delighting in you. We believe, Lord, and we put our faith in you, Lord, and we know that every day of every moment, you are guiding us to the right path according to your will and your purpose, Lord. And we pray for all those who are struggling, Lord, to see, to seek you, who are struggling to delight in you, Lord. We pray that you would meet them in their circumstance and they would seek you first and your joy, Lord. Thank you, Lord, that we can come to you and surrender everything, Lord. We love you, dear Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.